Hi, I'm Aruna Chauhan. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to talk about LMS. So LMS platforms are used globally across multiple different industries and for a variety of different learning enterprises. LMS adoption has been on the rise for the past several years all around the world. LMS, that's a learning management system, as the name is very helpful in understanding what it is, a sort of system that enables educators and trainers to manage student learning. While well, today the system is online and web-based using digital software and technology. So let's talk about more what LMS actually is. Well, LMS is designed to help an individual to develop, manage, and provide online courses and programs to learn. It provides a platform for the students and the instructor to learn and highlight their skills when, wherever and whenever they want as per their convenience. So, LMS covers almost all the major markets like um, medical industry, corporate sectors, educational institutions, schools, etc. It becomes handy in identifying the communication gap between the instructor and the learner by checking each individual's progress on uh, different discussions, quizzes, assessments, etc. So learning outcomes become more fun with the video tutorial, stories, features like gamification, Moreover, it enables educators and the trainers to manage student learning. It also supports the administration, automation, and delivery of educational courses and training programs. It also supports learning and development programs and deploy a variety of learning strategy. So it has a lot. So if we talk about uh, LMS deployment options or uh, we can see LMS implementations. So how it works. So um, generally open source learning management system are free and online based. Uh, users can modify the source code as per their needs and establish a consistent look and feel for um, their learning platform as well as the content. But um, a major drawback of an open space LMS is that the user will generally need some programming experience at hand to use this system effectively and efficiently. So there is um, usually a lot of customizations and of course it needs a lot of money. So the second type is the enterprise LMS, also known as commercial learning management system. These are typically easier to use and provide the users with a variety of support services and features. So an enterprise LMS have um, intuitive user interfaces and in some cases uh, asset libraries that help the learning administrator develop and deploy learning materials quickly. So um, basically if we see the learning management system uh, type is divided into two categories. One is software as a service. The vendor delivers support services and store all data in the cloud. And the second one is the installed LMS. These learning management systems are hosted locally on the purchasing organization server, make it easy to customize all aspects of LMS. Well, compared to the software as a service uh, LMS in which the vendor is responsible for services and sports, it's up to the organization's internal IT department to maintain the e-learning platform and make necessary upgrades. Well, if we talk about LMS, um, why we people are adopting it and what is the expertise? So the first thing is the mobile learning. While learning management system allow content to be assessed on 
mobile devices to better enable learning at the point of need. It provides personal space and choice of venue and whenever we like, we can learn. So formal, experiential and social learning, um, it's all you find in under one roof. Everything becomes digital, hence it saves a lot of money um, on buying ne uh, textbooks, copies or books. Formal learning management system help to streamline the learning pattern which in turn saves time for the instructor so that they can utilize that time to focus more on individual's progress. As things become digital and um, learning becomes more interesting with the existence of uh, video tutorials, clip, gamification, etc., it provides excellent way to learn more about your, um, your friends, your peer and teachers. So easy effective management is possible with LMS and the information accessibility becomes quick and accurate nowadays. So people love working together. LMS sports informal training activities to encourage um, idea sharing and to replicate the success of other. So LMS uh, include feature that encourage collaboration, discussion form, uh, mentorship and knowledge curation. So these uh, LMS systems are perfect so far the artificial intelligence is concerned. So artificial intel intelligence works uh, via a set of algorithms, processes or rules for calculations and decision making. In this case, the decision focus on providing learner and trainees with the optimum learning experience. Uh, complex um, artificial intelligence is able to provide information that is relevant to learners need and of sufficient challenge to be uh, motivating without being overwhelming at the same time. Moreover, it's a, a forward thinking approach. And if I talk about content personalization, while a learning management system offers uh, students the opportunity to customize their learning, an instructor-led course usually progresses through a set of a uh, series of lessons without taking into account the differences in prior knowledge of the learners. Since um, LMS is a library of content, a student can learn it at his own pace. So the next question is that who needs LMS system or who are the users of LMS? So students who have access to an LMS can see their course catalog, complete uh, assigned courses and any evaluation or measure their own progress. And so far administrators are concerned, these folks are responsible for managing the LMS, which involves a combination of multiple tasks, overseeing course management, uh, content management uh, that's creating training courses and learning plans for uh, contacting third-party content providers. So the teachers need that. Trainers use LMS for organizations to provide training to customers. Uh, this is especially common for software and technology companies uh, who need to effectively onboard users so they can use their products. Employees need that, general public needs that, external workers, etc. So it's for everyone. Well, if I talk about um, LMS used for or what are the features for that, so um, it reduces the um, it's used for to plan, implement, access a specific learning process. Uh, it's helpful in teaching learning process. Uh, it's helpful in customer training and employee on board. It's, uh, it's used for employee development and retention and compliance training. So um, it's easy to track the progress and reporting too. 
numbers don't lie. One of the most important feature of LMS that is that it includes the ability to track and measure the impact that your learning programs are having on your um, business or your learning environment. So now what are the benefits of this? Why people are using it at a tremendous pace? So one, it reduced the cost of the textbook, notebooks, and much teaching aids, expenditures used in face-to-face -face, uh, formal classrooms. It saves time, money, energy, and consistency of learning uh, attract many trainers and teachers. Every year you make modification in your um, training course. You can save that, improve that um, with the passage of time every year. It's easy to track the progress and reporting to. As I told you that numbers don't lie, one of the important feature and LMS uh, include is the ability to track and measure the impact that you your learning programs are having on your organization or your teaching learning process or business. So LMS uh, allow to drive learning insight through uh, customized reports and dashboards that provide metrics on learners' activity. So it also provide interactive environment. It's um, through gamification or uh, discussions, assignments, and engagement. Uh, it makes the teaching learning much more interesting. Now, uh, many people talk about that uh, it has some disadvantages to like it lacks motivation, uh, motivation. Some students need motivation. Uh, scope of wide thinking may be reduced, but personally, I think it's uh, it's individual differences. It's how you take the technology. So some people um, have uh, the opinion that the impact of face-to-face -face interaction is reduced. Uh, things can't be done physically. So I would say that, of course, these advantages um, uh, are a few, but the advantages are much more. So if we talk about certain LMS, um, a few popular learning management system uh, that are prevailing nowadays and uh, really working well are MindFlash. MindFlash is used for employee training on both virtual classrooms and compliance training. It provides uh, perfect content conversion features that will uh, let you create new courses, content, or uh, import the existing one. Uh, the second one um, that uh, nowadays is quite prevailing is Skype Prep. Is recognized by industry expert for its ease of use and outstanding customer support. The cloud, uh, the cloud based solution enables you to deliver, manage, and track your training with ease. Talent LMS is a very flexible learning management system that is developed to create a compact, most instinctive, simple, and hassle free learning experience. Moodle is um, quite prevailing and it's best for uh, teaching learning. It's open source and it's supported by a global community of developers uh, due to which localization becomes easy and is uh, highly configurable. Brightspace. Uh, well, it's a personalized learning experience and the course content is described very systematically. Uh, Adobe Captivate Prime LMS, uh, those who like video tutorials uh, with entertainments like gamification, etc. So it's best for them. Schoology, it offers a good amount of quizzes and assessment that increase the overall idea of the users on a particular learning program. While LMS has changed the learning perspective of every individual across the globe. So it has provided a wide scope for the users to choose and learn in uh, whichever field they want to excel, as all the information can now be shared across the globe. Have a nice time. Thank you for watching the video.